if anything goes wrong in my family, if there's a flat tire, they don't call fucking AAA. They call David fucking Goggins. My mom's got a problem, David. My mom's sick, David. Anybody, they call David. And that's earned. That's a good feeling. I believe in self-discipline, self-pride, self-motivation. No one has that self anymore. That self is gone. So that driving force that tells you, I have to do this shit, I took great pride in the fact that I was nobody. My mom would tell you right now, she's right there sitting. She is. She knows I don't buy myself shit. I take great pride in that. I don't want shit. Because how I'm wired, I'm wired to, hey mom, I'm gonna get you this, 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 and this. My girl, everybody's got everything. I don't even own a fucking car. And I'm a multi-millionaire. And I say that with pride. Yeah. Because what I was here to do, as a man, and men may not even want to hear this. It sounds so barbaric. That's the pride in what you have as a man. Is that you see your mom, you see your girl, you see your kids, you see all this shit. You see them doing well. That's all a real man wants. They don't give a fuck about how they dress, how they look, what they're driving. They don't give a shit. Because why? Your trophies are your family and they're all walking around. Every man that sees you, they they see you walking in with some sweatpants and shit, but they know your family's fucking balling because you put the fucking time in, you put the effort in, you put the work in. And as a man, we don't want none of that shit. We just want fucking respect. The parents raise the kids very differently now. It's just something that we almost can't teach our kids anymore because the world is influencing people from all over. Once they leave your house, you got this weak family and that weak family and that weak family saying, why is your dad like that? Why are you doing that? 